Hi, Jeff Goyne here with footflyer.com and I'm here to show you how to make your paramotor dramatically safer. Our highest risk for serious injury in a paramotor, strangely enough, is body contact with a spinning prop. Somehow getting a limb, shoulder, hand, arm, elbow, whatever, into the prop either while starting it, launching it, or landing it. Even on landing we've had injuries this way. What we have is a kit created by Sky Cruiser Manufacturing, Leon Wacker. We work together to come up with something that works best. It's one half inch tube, and then he has these ends on here. Four hose clamps for three quarter inch, half inch to three quarter inch, works well, and a screwdriver. This kit is $60, and you can make it on your own for less as long as you can roll or bend tubing. The kit comes in three segments in a flat box. And when you first get it, you'll notice there's a flat section at the bottom. He has them labeled so that when you put them together, you make sure to connect the ends correctly. Bottom is labeled for easy identification. Slide it in, push the button, wiggle until it snaps. Next piece, slide it in, push the button, wiggle, to make it easier to move until it snaps in place. This is the hard part, but we're going to do it last. You have to bend it down to get them to go together. You can see there's a push button there, bend it down, wiggle it to bring it apart. That'll be the hardest part for taking it apart. Now let's put it on the paramotor. The bottom section, as you see, is flat. That obviously is going to be worked around to the bottom. And you'll notice you don't have to do anything to take your paramotor apart. You leave the cage together and you just work it around between the radial arms and the netting. Follow this around with your hand. And there you're basically ready to put it together. We've got the bottom down there and then we're going to connect these over here. Once you have it together, center it, and you're going to use two hose clamps on each radial arm there to secure it in place. One hose clamp around that, another hose clamp around there. So you'll have the two hose clamps together like such. On most paramotors, this area in here is where the risk is. When the pilot starts, the motor comes forward and pushes hard against this shoulder. But with this, your shoulder would struggle to get to the prop. It's not perfect. Nothing beats a competent pilot treating his gear with respect and doing his flight operations properly, checking the throttle before every takeoff and making sure to start it with a good stance good support. This, nor anything, can do better than a smart pilot at the controls. But this can help a lot. Through a combination of well-designed equipment, we can go a long ways towards making this sport safer. For more information on where you can buy this, click on footflyer.com, go to the safety section, and then I'll have information on how you can buy this from Leon Wacker. Pricing at the time this video was made was $60 retail. There also is availability for bulk purchase. I'll have the information on how you can build it at home as well using the half inch aluminum and a screwdriver.